Disclaimer, a good day is never guaranteed. Maybe you're heartbroken. Maybe you're just in a shit mood. What I'm going to teach you is something that you can apply that can greatly increase your chances of having a good day. For me, it's that fuzzy feeling you get at the end of a long day when you just know that I fucking killed it. So I'm going to teach you how to fucking kill it every day. You're going to learn, one, the six keys to a good day. Two, using a to-do list the right way to keep yourself on track and provide accountability. Three, implementing a healthy reward system to keep yourself motivated and set a habit. Part one, the keys to a good day. If you do all six of these things, it's probably going to make your day better. Hey, are you even listening? Don't I roll at me. Look at you. You haven't showered. Your room's a mess. You've been sitting on your ass all day, playing that same game, avoiding work, and generally not giving a shit about the here and now in the world around you. Good. I actually just told you all six keys to a good day, but... Here they are again, a little more formally. One, hygiene. Your body is a temple. Keep it clean. Chores. Your home is a castle. Make it shine. Three, health. Be active and put some nice things in your mouth hole. Four, academic. Read, listen, learn new shit. Five, financial. Think of ways to make more and spend less. And six, finding peace. Find a way to come into being. Recap. There are six things we can focus on every day to make the chances of having a good day better. They are hygiene, chores, health, academic, financial, and finding peace. Next, I'm going to show you how to take these general concepts and turn them into action. So now you know the six keys to a good day. It's time to get specific so you can start to see some change. Sometime after you wake up and before starting your day, you need to make a list. Write out the six keys to a good day at the top. Then you're going to make a specific choice for each one. There's one thing that you have to do every single day. Brush your teeth. This is non-negotiable. After that, it's all up to you. Chores could be go shopping. Health could be eat a vegetable with every meal today. Academic could be listen to that band you've heard about but haven't ever listened to. Financial could be set a budget for the month. And finding peace, you could just go outside for 10 minutes and just sit with your thoughts and your existential dread. Maybe it'll go away, maybe not, I don't know. Anyway, you should do it. That's pretty much it, but write it down and be specific, and then be more specific. If you're gonna go shopping, write down what you need to buy underneath that. If you're gonna go try to make your chest swole like Arnold Schwarzenegger, write down the specific exercises you're doing today. The only one where I think generalities are more effective is probably finding peace. After you decide to meditate or whatever the fuck you think is gonna make you come into the here and now or whatever, just leave it at that and let whatever happens, happens. If you haven't gotten the hint, write all this shit down. Someone at some college did some study and found that most people are more likely to do stuff if they write it down. Recap. Make a to-do list choosing one specific item that falls under each key to a good day. Get specific with what you're doing for each one. Write it down. Lastly, part three, making a habit. The way a habit forms is with a cue, like being bored, a response, like deciding to go to the bar, and a reward, like getting drunk. This last part is what you're going to do to solidify all this life-changing shit. No, not getting drunk. Reward setting. If you complete your list, be sure to reward yourself. Nothing huge. An apple, some TV, maybe a kombucha if you had a really hard day. For me, being able to X off all the boxes is pretty ample. Just pick something you enjoy that you can relate to the effort you put in during the day. Recap. If you want to make this a habit to change your life, associate a reward with completing your list. Let's go over all that shit one last time. There are six areas of life that should be attended to on the daily. Not on the fly, not on the regular, on the daily. They are hygiene, chores, health, academic, financial, and finding peace. Get specific with that shit and write down what you're going to do for each one on a daily to-do list. And then create a habit by associating a reward with completing your daily list. Those are the keys to a good day. Do that shit and I swear your mood will start to improve. And you'll sleep well knowing that you fucking killed it. Good job.